We're on a white sand beach, and that building there is exactly what my hotel will look like, only my hotel will be three rooms wide, not five. And that will be two inches away from my hotel. I have the same design, the same amount of flaws, and my hotel is to the right, right where that big tree is over there. So let's go see what the neighbors are doing. Now I have to try to remember several people's names that I haven't seen in a very long time. This area here, when they have big parties, they'll pitch a huge tent here. And because uh, it's a flat area and they'll throw up barbecue and they'll have uh, roasted pigs. Now that hasn't happened since the lockdown that I that I know of. Now this, where we're going to go on, this is a property where this fence starts here and it goes down 600 feet, 400 feet that way and then it zigzags in and then it goes another I think 200 feet. I think it's 600 or 700 feet wide and it goes from the beach to the main road which is 800 feet and this is the site of uh, several hundred rooms 18 billion peso resort that they're preparing to break ground for and eventually where we're, I'm going to be walking back here eventually there'll be a hotel back in this area here. Are you? Are you blind? Are you blind? Yeah. <laughs> Hello. Hello, my friend. Mayan Hapun. Mayan Uto. Mayan Uto Pod. What? He, he can't see today. He has his eyes are gubat. Ah, oh, libat. In Visayan term, libat. Libat. Uh, and then? I don't know. When when will they start building? When will they start building? Stop. When when start the hotel? Okay. The no, no, construction. No more. We don't have construction. It's only up to the. Buckle, buckle. When is okay. the big resort? The big resort. They're no, building no. a resort here, no, no more? No, no. We don't have only the, the owner in this return, only the land. land. Yeah? Keith, Keith told me they were building a resort. Remember Keith? No, no, no. No resort here? No, Mark, no. The kit engineer is only the contractor. Contractor, yeah. But the owner is in Great Britain. So no resort? No. Okay. Okay. You, you don't know here. Why I go over there? Coconut, young, bobo. Ah. <laughs> Toba. No. The kind of young Just coconut. drink? Okay. Okay. Coconut. All right. You have a nice day. I, I, I don't want to go down there. I wanted to... I thought maybe they might be the machines over there. No, no resort then, yeah? No, no. Okay. This is the hardest working man in the Philippines, right there. When he wants to work, he is the hardest. No, no, I went tired. You're not the look. When he wants to work, he can do the work of three, three men. Not one. Like a jackhammer. At the back. Like, like that. That way. Hello, goat. Hello, Billy. Hello, goat. Hello, baby Conding. Hello, baby Conding. You good? Are you good? Okay. Umping. Who, oh, over there? Baby Conding? Michael. Michael also. Sangai? Hey, Sangai. The same, the same name. How are you? The same name. Mm. We are both Niwang too. And you are Bye, Bakakun Ka. You are Bakakun. Hello, baby goat. Hello, mama. 
That's Tambok. I am the one. Guapo ka! My Nuto Pud. Ah, there's more baby goats. Oh. Baby goat, baby canding. Babai canding. Look, see the one over there? Look at how small that one is. That one only weighs a few kilos. Hello, mama. Hello, mama. Wow. This is why I like living in, where I live here in the Philippines. You get to see goats. Now, sometimes there's cows. Not here. The cow was in a different place. Hello, baby canding. Hello, mama. Hello. Hello, mama. Hello. Uh-oh. We disturbed them. Okay, so, um, that's the end of this video. I guess I was told that they were going to build 700 plus rooms here and I still believe that's going to happen. Although, although, it is possible it got canceled because of the, uh, because of the lockdown. A lot of big buildings stopped instantly when the lockdown came. So, and the contractor, I knew the contractor, I know the contractor. Hey, Popper, come here, boy. Come on over here, big guy, come on, come on. Hey, 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 come here. You know who I am. When I, when they were puppies. Come here, come here. Hello, good boy, hello, come on. You're a good boy, yeah. Oh, yeah. You're, you're a good boy. You're good boys. It's Michael. It's Michael. You remember I used to give you bones. I gave you bones. Oh, for years. All those bones. All those bones mean nothing to you. When they were puppies, I remember when they were so small they could get under the gate. And now, I haven't given them bones in a few years. <laughs> Go figure. <laughs> isn't, isn't, that the, isn't that the way of the Philippines? You have to continually give for the love to be shared in both directions. Now this property was owned by a man in Switzerland. Denmark or Switzerland. And well, when I first moved here, this place was, whew, he was living here, exotic. There were 10,000 plus beautiful exotic plants in flower pots and boxes back here. Maybe more than 10,000. There were all kinds of atriums and atrariums here and everything. And the man died, I think. Pretty sure the man died. And within a few months, the all the flower pots and all the the beautiful statues and stuff that were small enough to carry away were given to anybody that wanted to come and get them by the family rather than to just see the plants die so for months there were people going through this gate with two or three or four boxes of plants and stuff like that it was an amazing thing all right so that's the end of this video Thanks for watching. I'm Big Permi from Michael Fazio in the Philippines, baby.